The Inheritance is about three different generations of gay men, and so it really touches on what it is to be a gay man now. But it's also about what it means to stand on the shoulders of those who have come before you. I think the audience will be most surprised by the sort of poetic elements of the play. For me, that's one of the most wonderful things about it, is that it can jump from like real naughtiness and then sort of bring you to tears in the next moment. And I find myself watching scenes that I've seen, you know, quite a few times and I just hear something new for the first time. So I, I just think it's, it's, as Stephen Daldry says, it's incredibly Moorish. And I think people will leave the theatre feeling both profoundly grateful to be uh, a human being in this time and also very reflective. Stephen is a joy. He is one of the funniest people I've ever met and he creates one of the safest rehearsal rooms I've ever been in where you are willing to try something, make a fool of yourself, you know. I, the phrase I use is, you know, sometimes you do something that's strong but wrong, you know, so it's a really bold choice but it's not quite right and you can do that in that room. I, I, maybe I can share a story with you about the day we found out that she was in the play. They didn't tell us, they didn't tell the cast. And so we're rehearsing a scene in, in Walks Vanessa Redgrave. Even from an audience perspective, to be able to see a legend like Vanessa working with a legend like Steven, uh, with all of these young men. I don't know how many times that happens in a lifetime. I think that's one of the most wonderful things about it and why it's so important as a play, that it can really show a community in like every way that it is. And I think both gay men and gay women and straight men and straight women and everything in between will come and watch it and really feel like they've seen the full picture at last.